Hi, everyone. I'm Emily. I'm a product marketer here at Snowflake. And with me today, I have Philip Coletti, a product manager at Snowflake. We're here to discuss hybrid tables, which are now public preview on AWS. Thanks for joining, Philip. Thanks for having me, Emily. Wonderful. All right. So let's dive right in. What are hybrid tables? Hybrid tables are a new Snowflake table type that offer high concurrency, double digit millisecond point operations natively inside Snowflake, all alongside the analytical queries and functionality that you already love inside Snowflake. They're integrated seamlessly into the Snowflake data cloud. This allows customers to support hybrid and lightweight transactional workloads directly on Snowflake, reducing the complexity of having to manage, synchronize, and operate multiple different database technologies and platforms. Great. So let's dive a little bit deeper into the features of hybrid tables that help customers power those hybrid and lightweight transactional use cases that you mentioned above. Hybrid tables bring a lot of changes to the Snowflake platform to power those use cases. I'll just cover a few of the most important changes that really make hybrid tables shine on those hybrid workloads. The first is performance and specifically performance on point operations, so those point reads and writes. And we do this in, in two main ways. Hybrid tables are built on a brand new row storage engine, and then also hybrid tables introduce optimizations into the cloud services and warehouse layers in order to reduce overhead and really make that row storage engine shine. The second is row locking. Hybrid tables use row locking to facilitate high concurrency writes so if you have multiple users or clients that are connecting to the application and modifying different records, they can all do that concurrently without running into any sort of contention. Hybrid tables also support some of the features that you require for various transactional workloads. Uh, this includes things like constraint enforcement. Hybrid tables support primary key enforcement, uh, so enforcing uniqueness on different record primary keys. Uh, and they also support foreign key constraints, which enforce referential integrity between different tables. Hybrid tables also support secondary indexes, so you can get snappy lookups on common access paths. Those indexes are maintained synchronously on write, um, so if you modify a record, uh, it can be retrieved quickly and displayed uh, in your application, uh, which is really important for some transactional applications. Lastly, and, and probably most importantly, hybrid tables are integrated seamlessly into the Snowflake platform, and you can use them seamlessly with other Snowflake table types. That sounds lofty, so I'm going to try to make that concrete. Uh, specifically, you can join a hybrid table and a standard table, and that query will execute natively and efficiently within the same Snowflake query engine. No federation, no copying data. Also, you can even run an atomic transaction across a hybrid table and a standard table to ensure consistency across all of your data within Snowflake. All right, so what are some of the benefits that our customers who have been using this feature throughout private preview and now into public preview are experiencing with hybrid tables? It's a good question, Emily. The one thing that customers talk to me the most about is simplification. Customers have been using hybrid tables to simplify their architectures by powering some of those lightweight transactional and hybrid use cases directly inside Snowflake, uh, which really reduces the complexity of having to uh, synchronize, manage, and operate multiple different database technologies and platforms. The second benefit is that they're really easy to use and, and governed all within that one Snowflake data platform. So they know that the features that they need, like primary keys and referential integrity, will work on these use cases, uh, meeting them right where they are, where their applications are already built. But then also Snowflake's capabilities like row-based access control and masking policies will also work with hybrid tables directly out of the box. So they have that one central consistent governance without needing to make any changes. And then lastly, uh, because of this, this new approach that we're taking, Hybrid tables and Unistore more broadly can really unlock some powerful new use cases. Being able to bring this new transactional data to your existing analytical workloads on Snowflake and power new data applications on top of that can be really powerful. Um, having access to that data in, in near real time without impacting your ongoing operational workload can, can be really powerful. All right, so let's dive into some of these use cases. How have we seen customers using hybrid tables for so far? 
we've seen customers use hybrid tables for a range of hybrid use cases from application state to data serving to some lightweight transactional applications. A few that come to mind are we have Franklin Templeton, Siemens, IQVIA, and MarketWise using hybrid tables for workflow state. Uh, so they use hybrid tables to maintain metadata, logging, and orchestration information for concurrent workers of their ETL pipelines that are centered around Snowflake. We have other customers like William Hill using hybrid tables for serving pre-computed promotional treatment through their online and mobile applications. And then we also work with a global customer that has moved uh, an internal access management application and a distributor discounting application from SQL Server over to Snowflake using hybrid tables to power that interactive transactional app. Looking to the future, um, we're really excited to work with you, our customers, on a range of use cases that you might want to bring to Snowflake and test out with hybrid tables. Uh, we're going to continue to improve the performance the scale and the feature coverage of hybrid tables throughout the public preview into GA and beyond uh, to cover a, a broader range of use cases and really expand what you can do with the data cloud. And this is really just the beginning for hybrid tables and the Unistore workload more broadly. So please stay tuned as we roll out those improvements um, and also as we expand coverage to the remainder of AWS regions and the other cloud providers that Snowflake supports as well. Thanks. Wonderful. Thank you, Philip. And for those of you who are interested in getting started with hybrid tables, check out the links um, below in this YouTube video. Uh, those will help you get started with everything you need from docs um, and other resources. All right, thank you again, Philip, and enjoy building. Bye.